A spooky Halloween display is doing more than just bringing the community together in Oroville. Action News Now reporter Chloe Curtis shows us how one family is decorating for a good cause. This guy is a little bit taller than me. I'm about 5'5". Five five. He's 12 feet tall. But the skeleton is out here for a lot more than decoration. They put out the skeleton and I was like, I have to have that. <laughs> The skeleton became the first of many decorations outside the Crosby's home on 5th Street in Oroville. This year, it's helping raise money for children's research through skeletons for St. Jude. I just, I love St. Jude. I think it's one of the best causes out there, so it was something I could get behind. The fundraiser raises money during the 2023 Halloween and holiday season. Nationwide, about $150,000 has been raised so far. <laughs> But it's not just helping St. Jude that's putting a smile on the Crosby's face. It's the community. The Crosby's come out here every night once it's dark enough to turn on all these lights and say they get all kinds of visitors from the community. For the kids and for the seniors, the seniors really, really love it. Aww. Yeah, and I love seeing them be so happy about it. Making all the time that goes into decorating worth it. How long does it take to set up a display like this? A couple weeks. It takes us a couple weeks. Most of these decorations will come down after Halloween, but the Crosby say the skeleton may stick around all year. I think we'll keep a skeleton out for Christmas. Maybe we, put a hat on him. <laughs> yeah, he's got a Santa hat. He's got a 11 foot tree. He's going to put a star on. But this spooky tradition, one the family says they'll keep going for years to come. All right, so what do you think of all the decorations? That's all right, he's, he's a little shy, but if you would like to swing by and see all these decorations, they'll be up through the end of the month. In Oroville, Chloe Curtis, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. I don't know if he's shy, Chloe. It looks like he wants to eat you or something. All right, uh, well, uh,